that. So let's open up fun fact though. Today get a really, really, really quick um Duncan Bell video I want to do though. Really quick, of course. Um but yeah, I'm back though. Um it's been about a couple of days since I recorded though. But yeah, um, we did get some pretty good new um new news for um Goba and for um pretty much Goba engine kind of I know it's like a hunt tech comes out tonight ish. Around 15, 14 more hours by the time the video goes up. Maybe a little bit. Um of course you know we got um thank you stuff right here. I was gonna say just for this video anyway. Um this whole big thing right here. But they're saying thank you for the download celebration um, and stuff like that. You know, thank you so much for your support. Um, stuff like that for both Global and JP. Of course, they both take it their stones. And of course, right here, I want to say, I've also went off screen. I'm going to get a wallpaper. Of course, it's full of anime with Majin Buu in the background. I think I went over this in my breakdown video, which I'll look over around here or in the app above. Um, but yeah, um, it's pretty simple there, of course. But yeah, I was like, okay, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. Because um, I'm thinking, it's like, when are they going to release this? Um, I mean, we already got like three wallpapers, basically all of the title screens. Um, part one, part two, um, part three ish. <laughs> we really want to get technical. Um, but yeah, um, again, all this base is rolled into one, though, of course. So yeah, again, um, for both Cobra and JP, they do have this. I do actually like this wallpaper, though. It's really funny. Of course, pretty cool. Um, also, JP got some good news on the side. They are getting the. Um, 4 point, um, 4 point 12 points are update. So yeah, um, I kind of saw that a few days ago too. I was like, um, I forgot about it because this came out the same day um, as the wallpaper and stuff like that. Like those two kind of came out on the same day. I was just like, I was waiting for the v um, Frieza breakdown video when I did it. Um, for this whole campaign, because we do have Frieza's campaign and both fully out now. Yeah, and I was just like, oh, okay, let's just, you know. Um, go over this when it comes out and stuff like that. So, yeah, pick up the start of this down celebration. Um, mid down celebration. My lord! Update videos. So, yeah, of course, it's some of the new stuff that's coming with the update. Um, you can see when you tap on the orbs, like when you tap on it and stuff like that, when you hold it down, you can see like what orbs you get in a row. Like, it'll tell you like, how many orbs you'll get, like your super attack and stuff like that down here, which is really helpful. I've been begging them to do this for like a long minute. For me specifically, because I am thinking about this stuff when I'm doing or like when I'm doing sort of battle rope runs or, or, or like runs in general when I'm holding it down. Or I think when you let it go, it's about that it'll tell you how many orbs you got. Um it'll tell you like um, you know, oh yeah, here's enough for a super attack, here's um, you know, enough orbs and stuff like that. Or you line it up and stuff like that, it'll tell you how many like if you have like super attack ready or you know, um again it was in like a row or whatever, which I love, 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 thank god. Thank god man, I really wanted this for a long time because I'm always kinda thinking about stuff when I'm battling a token. Um, <laughs> they can battle, yeah. but yeah, I'm always constantly thinking about this stuff anyway, though, so it's like, uh, I'm kind of glad they are doing this, though, I'm so glad, because, oh boy, man, I need this for like a long time, I really need this, um, so, because I do kind of think about this stuff, you know, in battle, and like, it's like, oh, do I have enough orbs, do I have enough STR orbs, do I have enough of this, um, so basically, basically for beginners, it's going to be really good if you're on the global, global on JP, for global, it's probably be like, what, two, three months from now, about a month or two, they tend to get these kind of updates up, about a month or two later, Back then, I think back in the day, I think like a couple months ago, it was like two or three months. They usually get these type of updates, but for global, I want to say I would really want to say around like um, about two three months. I'll say about a month or two. They never um they never like for updates to like that global doesn't really left behind. They tend to keep, uh, trying to keep it up with JP. They tend to do it like about again like a month later or whatever. They already know do the video when it comes out. So yeah, we have it on. We tap on it hard enough. Or we hold on the um, you know, the orbs on the map and stuff like that. It'll say how much you can get. Um, in a row and stuff like that. It'll be like eight, nine, ten. It'll say how much you get enough for attack. Which I'm so glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. But it's a super battle row. If you, because you need, it's a, you actually do need super attack. And even if you're in that stage, or you know, you're kind of dead. But yeah, um, they're right here. I think it's another update when um separately. I think now we have like Kaiser stuff like that. You know. Um, it'll, it won't add up to your overall box total right here, so basically, you have like all the cards and stuff like that, they'll be in their own separate tier, like their own separate tier, like, you know, the end way, like, when you see all the tags, the very, very end, you'll see like all your stuff you can't use, Kai's, um, that one, um, Boma, Valentine's Day card, stuff like that, it'll basically tell you, like, hey, you can't really use these guys, um, you can only use them for super attacks, I think they'll be in their own separate tier, so they will not, not add up to your box space, again, they're gonna make their own separate thing, they're gonna add up in their own box space, so they're gonna be in their own box space separately, which I'm so glad because man, they take that um because they they factor in your own box space as well. So basically, how many cards you get, it will be it will be in your total overall box space. I'm so glad they're doing this. I'm so glad because I don't know what's cards anymore like that. Um, I do. I mean, I have almost almost all my units are basically almost SA10 anyway though. So yeah. Um, basically it's kind of like that. We're almost like SA10. Um, anyway, so I don't really need to use cards like that anymore. I do like to save them up like you know. And also I'm gone though. He does have a farm boost project. Um, Terminal Power Stages and stuff like that. He does have a formal super attack. <laughs> I remember when the original STR one, OG one came out, and everybody was like, Oh, yeah, we can just, we can just do skies week later. Oh, yeah, 
free play go on. It didn't really matter. But yeah. Um, this is pretty good though, of course, for that update. Of course, we got the new training um, campaign, super training campaign up for JP right now. Of course, it's live in the game. If you want to go check it out, you can. Um, again, I'll drop it up for all of the ones this one big video. So yeah, of course, you know, typical stuff like that goes up for this campaign. Login bonus, special missions, typical stuff. We have um, Andrew Gordon Frieza shipping in about 13, 14, 15 more hours, however the time zones are in. Um, for me, it's about 15, 13 hours. Again, by the time the demo celebration fully ends. So if you haven't summoned already, go ahead and do it. Um, by the time the video goes up, hopefully, the event now celebration stuff will still be up. Um, might need to summon a little bit more. I don't know how I feel. It doesn't really matter though. But yeah, Kyle Kimbo Goku's coming back to make sense, stuff like that. Really stupid he didn't come back on, um, um, the, um, Tanabata celebration. Really stupid that he didn't come back. I can even agree with my, myself as well. Um, he didn't come back, but I guess they're kind of trying to stand up. Okay, let's, they're like, okay, let's make sure after the demo celebration we can bring this guy back. Um, I want to say for, um, Arthur was still speculating Cooler, Kefla, stuff like that, coming back on the fair too. Kefla makes sense, Cooler also makes sense as well, you know, STR, Freeze Physical, and Freeze Physical, and stuff like that, really makes sense. Um, I think it's, um, Berserk Warriors category banner. Um, or, you know, um, in a battle of wits, I think it's um, Berserk Warriors. Um, again, all these guys, they've been, again, they're getting awakening and stuff like that. Um, I feel like the Goku and Python could get easy A's. I feel like they just kind of can get it in. No, the Kevlar celebration is just throwing a whole bunch of stuff. The Kai banner, stone sales. Um, Golden Freeze's um, Doki events getting updated. We got the story event. This freeze is down here. Um, alternate power stages coming back. Um, new battlefield and stuff like that, of course. Um, new chain battles, so we'll probably see something new there. Um, ooh, we got some new stuff down here. So we got Imp Kid Billy King, his easy and stuff like that. Um, a new freeze event right here. A super fierce um, event you can do every single day. Okay, yeah, in Kid Buu's event's coming back up. Red's ZZA, I mean, Red's story event and stuff like that is coming back. I'm um, probably specifically for that ZZA. I don't know when Gold is going to get that. I want to say probably maybe December, November. I was October would be pretty, pretty perfect for Halloween and stuff like that. Like for a Halloween celebration. Because all stuff ends around, I think, the yeah, 30th slash. Um, oh, dang, Halloween's on a Friday on um, Saturday. I think Slash was on a Friday, I remember that. But yeah, um, all this stuff again, though, around near ending Halloween, yeah, almost Wednesday. Um, yeah, like a few days before Halloween even starts. So yeah, we're gonna get a Halloween celebration. We got one every year. It's stuff like that, you know, autumn, spring, fall, you know, Christmas celebration. We get those a lot every year. So yeah, Inky Boots getting his ZZA, right? ZZA is coming back. We got new, of course, um, Chain Battle again, which that should be up in a couple more days as well. Again, I got lots of videos to record. I'm happy. It's been a couple minutes long. Nick, still really doing a video and stuff like that. Again, the video should be ready sooner or later. Um, of course, go to freeze and stuff like that. You're no gracious. Um, <laughs> that boy's already going crazy over this, so yeah. Um, again, Kakabuga coming back is good and stuff like that. Again, pretty good celebration stuff in here. Of course, we got Inka Bugu and ZTA. Um, I just just logging and stuff. I know these are all missions down here. Basic simple stuff, you know, like open up potential paths, the awaken a character, train, do a dozen fest events, stuff like that. We got a lot of missions going here anyway, though, so yeah. Uh, it says revenge training story event. So yeah, it's a, it's a revenge training story event for the Frieza event. Um, yeah, here just special missions and stuff like that. Um, again, it should be a couple more hours. So yeah, about 13 more hours. I want to say right here is um, for the new free play Frieza. So yeah, he does tech. Um, I didn't really go over him that much, though, but yeah, I'm going to go over him right now. He does tech types, key one, everything up, um, 12, uh, 25%, supreme damage, HP um, passive, um, attack defense up 90%, HP is 50, um, 50% or more, uh, reduces damage by 30% with HP is 59% or more. His links are new Frieza Army. Um, uh, that should be a category right now, Freezer Army. I feel like they want to do it this Freezer Base from Dragon Ball Super. I'm kind of glad they did not make them a new category. I'm so glad they did not do that. Um, Brainiacs, Coward, Cold Judgment, Death for Conquest, Prodigy, and the category is Trying to Find Conquerors. But well, at that, he does wait, don't come with the Golden Freezer and Sword Bay. I want to say they are from Dragon Ball Super because, you know, this is not a uh, movie boss. Is that why? I, I, I was confused. I was like, wait a minute. Why is not a movie boss? Oh, yeah, Sword Bay's in there. Again, we need like a movie category, like overall movie category. Like a movie, like a full-on movie heroes and maybe a full-on movie villains, just kind of differentiate them. What is the overall category though? So yeah, so he does join forces key two, everything up 50%. I feel like he's gonna get an easy A. I feel like easy A, but at the same time the down celebration just have four of them. I feel like they wouldn't really push out easy like this really early, in my opinion. I really feel like they wouldn't do that, but you know, right after the down celebration. I feel like they are because when they usually do this, like you know, treat, um, you know, a category, you know, or um Something else, you know, key to everything at 50%, that means you're gonna get an ETA. So his key is highly gonna get an ETA. It's really dang darn obvious. It's like putting icing on a cake. Or, you know, petting your dog. It's really that easy. I'm just saying, it's really that easy. Or tech type key to everything up 30%. Uh, Sweet damage, high chance of stunning. Um, Oh, that's actually really good. He's gonna be really good. I mean, free play slash, you know, ETA unit. 
Attack and defense plus 120, attack plus 50%, I went mean, HP 50% or more. T2, I heard it's like this kind of like a feedback and forth with him. T6 and performs a uh, critical um, enemy is stunned. So basically, you know, he's gonna be, again, he's gonna be super good for like extreme spell battle road. Again, easy, eh? <laughs> um, when um, attacking in the same turn, after receiving, yeah, when attacking in the same, when the enemy um, hits and stuns the attacked enemy in the same turn after receiving an attack, reduce damage by 50% um, when, when HP is 59% or less. Um, so his links are, um, I think he just gets Coward, um, just uh, Coward, Cold Judgment, and Shattering Limit, and Prodigies. Um, his categories do change to Joint Forces, Final Trump Card, and of course Battle of Wits. Makes sense he's on Battle of Wits, even though it seems Scorpay in the background, you know. Like a cheap shot. It, that was more of an active skill thing, was going on for his Yeah, he had a, um, he had to look at the circuit effect to spiral, like, energy in the background, and his aura. Um, yeah, so we're doing, like, a cheap shot. Yeah, that's was what Shadow's strategy. I was thinking like he's gonna be a lot for slash final jump card because of this. But yeah, that's um all if I want to go below today. Of course, um the celebration was pretty good though. Of course, gonna make an overall video for that. Alright, after this, I'm gonna wanna go below that video. We got the freezer campaign. Of course, it should be in a couple more hours. But yeah, so I really wanna go over today. Like I said, it really wasn't gonna make this that long. Hopefully everything you guys got everything you really needed and stuff like that. Of course, see you guys there though, because I was watching a great day, great life. Oh, good joke. You know, so I think pretty good stuff, pretty good simple stuff, of course. Um, but yeah, well, the video should be about a couple more hours, maybe about time the video goes up. I did do an overall video for them. Should be somewhere around me on the Apple Book. Doesn't matter though. I mean, it doesn't matter if you guys care. <laughs> Joking there. So yeah, see you guys later though. Again though, peace out.